Hi, I'm Luther Tan. Today I'm going to teach you how to build EA through the EA Builder. This is the overview. First, I will review the forexadvisor.com and then I will point out what Forex Advisor can do, what Forex Advisor could do, and also teach you step by step how to create the EA through the Forex Advisor EA Builder. Okay, so I'm going to rate this uh, Forex Advisor. So, from my experience, let's say I consider myself if I'm a new newbie in the EA building so I will rate this 4 star out of 5 star because of it it is easier to be used and it's quite easy to be understand so as a beginner of the to build the EA this is quite very simple to learn in terms of the strategy supports the strategy are supported by um, this forex advisor is quite complete However, it is a basic form where I will tell you tell you more in later part where you can build on the buy trade, sell trade and also on the closing buy trade and also when the closing sell trade. It supports all kind of different indicators in the in the MT4, almost all of the list. Nevertheless, this Forex Advisor EA Builder, it is just only suitable for all the basic robot building, not for complex robot building. So, what could this EA Builder do? You can create, you can use this EA Builder to build your uh, buying strategy the sell trade strategy, closing strategy for the buying and selling trades, and you're able to set a single lot size for all the trade, same lot size. You're able to set the take profit pips and also stop loss pip. You are also able to compare the ask price, bid price, Close price, high price, open price, low price, value, hours, and minutes. I will show you how to use all of these in later slides. You also can use the indicators that is available in MT4. So this is the list of the indicators. So you might be familiar with the accelerator and this accelerator accumulation distribution a ADX alligator Bollinger Bands bear powers bull powers right MACD moving average RSI relative strength index and etc you also can build a multiple condition check through the N and all operator you also can use the symbol as like larger than or smaller than and also the equal operator to make the comparison. So this is all that they can do. On the other hand, there are several stuff that this EA Builder couldn't do. First, this EA Builder is only support the general stop loss and also the general take profit pips. So this means that if you have 10 trades and all of your trades have a similar stop loss and take profit pips, like for example, if you set to 20 pips for the take profit and you set to 10 pips for the stop loss, then all of your 10 trades will be have a similar gaps of the take profit pips and also stop loss pips. All right. So similar to the lot size, same lot size is being used for all the trades. So you couldn't change. Say if you want to 
have a different lot size for different trades so this builder this EA builder does not support it next this EA builder it just only support the larger than and also smaller than an equal operator to make the comparison between the both of uh, the price but there are some times that you need to um, you need to use small operator like for example larger than or smaller than operator all right another point when you need to when you want to do a comparison checking for multiple condition checks so in this case the EA builder support the N and also the all operator but there are more details of the criteria check that you can do more details or more different check so this EA builder does not support it so for all the EA builder that I came across could I do this so the solution is either you need to build the EA yourself or you need to hire an expert programmer All right. so now I want to show you how to use this EA builder to build your trade so my examples of this my trade strategy is I want to do a buy trade when the hours is more than 10 and lesser than 20 means that in the 10 o'clock in the midnight I will stop the buying trade and I want to start this buying trade when I start from 10 o'clock in the morning okay given the condition where I'm checking the price of the 5 moving average is less than the price of the 10 moving average alright so I have few condition check right here one two three okay let's switch to the web and let's see how I can do this to change this the trade strategy inside the uh, forex advisor the EA builder okay so this is the EA builder site come to this uh, EA generator and you will be given this site so just through this uh, drag and drop and different tabs that then you can build your own uh, robot okay now follow back my examples I want to do a um, buy trade so I uh, choose this open buy and I want to choose the hours so I can choose this hour all right just wait for a while and then refresh all right so whenever you have choose something then um, this uh, site will refresh to take effect so right now I want to choose this hour is let's say from my trade strategy my uh, when I'm my hours is more than so I want to choose my hour is more than so now I can choose this value then it will give you a text box to enter the value so says my I want to start my trade to checking trade from 10 o'clock in the morning okay so this is one condition check and I want to stop the trade when the hour is lesser than um, in the night o'clock in, in, in at the night 10 o'clock so again I want to do the same thing I'll go to choose hour and then lesser than the, when the hour is lesser than value can choose the value now I can enter the value that I want which is a 20 so 10 o'clock sorry 10 o'clock is a 22 in the night time is 22 so we are going to 24 hours format yeah okay the third condition is 
I want to check on the, my moving average. Okay, so at this point, you can see there is an AND or OR. This AND operator and OR operator, I will describe in another, another um, tutorial what is the difference between AND and OR. But at this point, you just need to know that to meet all conditions, you need to choose AND operator. So to add on another condition, just click on add and then they will give you another condition and so this condition I also want to have want to meet in order to create a buy trade so now I want to choose a indicator I want to use yeah so I'll choosing this moving average Okay, so as you can see, when the site is refreshed, the new pop-up will be shown. So this is all the value or parameter that you need to key in for the moving average. So what is the moving average, the value that you want to um, trade? Like for example, for the time frame, so I will choose uh, maybe H1. So what is the period value? MA shift value. So in case that you don't know this, you should always refer to your MT4. So let's say you double click this moving average. So this is all the parameter that you should set. All right. So the period with five shifting zero, uh, exponential, and apply to the price close. So apply to the same. All the value in the um, EA builder. So I will choose this to 5 shift MA shift. So let's say I'm using the exponential mode EMA. This means the exponential, exponential moving average. So price close shift is 0. Now at this right hand side. I'm checking another price. So here, when I this five moving average, I want to check whether it's uh, larger than or smaller than. So says I want to check on the smaller than. Now I want to choose another price to compare. So I will choose this again, moving average. So again, scroll down. You need to fill in all the text right here. So right now I want to choose let's say 13. Shift again to 0. Maybe I choose a simple moving average. Close price shift equal to 0. So once you have um, write all your criteria right here or the condition, move forward to the expert advisor code. All right. So you can see this is uh, still empty. Click generate. Okay. So this is the code that is uh, generated by this uh, forexadvisor.com. So as you can see right here, there is a claim right here that you cannot delete this header file because this is a proprietary code that is generated by this forex advisor so to respect the code and also effort that is being built by this site so we we'll just leave it as it and this is all the code that is generated so maybe you do not know what is this code, this all means for but maybe let me um, validate where is a uh, right here is writing correctly or not or being generated correctly so the hours right here is uh, more than 10, correct? Smaller than 20, correct? So this is the, another the third criteria check for my moving average. The first is um, need to be smaller than the third one, which is correct. So here I do my buy. Yes, this is correct. All right. Okay, so, so um, so after you have generated this one, you can save the codes. 
all right so this is the dot mq4 script that is generated by your uh, this forex advisor okay so you can use this in your um, ea so in the metatrader 4 so i will sh i will show you how to include this dot mq4 in the metatrader 4 in another tutorial all right so i have shown you how to build the ea through this ea builder all right so this concludes the chapter so for more free video please visit the mt4programmingcourse.com if you find this video helps you give me a like and subscribe my youtube channel again thank you for watching and happy learning